Rai Bahadur Sir Upendranath Brahmachari Bengali Upendranatha Brahmakari the 19th of December 1873 to the 6th of February 1946 was an Indian scientist and a leading medical practitioner of his time He synthesized urea stibamine in 1922 and determined that it was an effective substitute for the other antimony containing compounds in the treatment of kala azar visceral leishmaniasis which is caused by a protozoan leishmania donovani his discovery led to the saving of thousands of lives in India, particularly in the erstwhile province of Assam, where several villages were completely depopulated by the devastating disease. The achievement of Brahmachari was a milestone in successful application of science in medical treatment in the years before arrival of antibiotics, when there were few specific drugs, including quinine for malaria, iron for anemia, digitalis for heart diseases and arsenic compounds for syphilis. Most other ailments were treated symptomatically by palliative methods. Urea stibamine was thus a significant addition to the arsenal of specific medicines. <laughs> Early life Upendranath Brahmachari was born on 19 December 1873 in Sardanga village near Purbasthali, district Burdwan of West Bengal, India. His father Nilmani Brahmachari was a physician in East Indian Railways. His mother's name was Saurabh Sundari Devi. He completed his early education from Eastern Railways Boys High School, Jamalpur. In 1893, he passed BA degree from Hooghly Mohsen College with honours in mathematics and chemistry. Thereafter he went to study medicine with higher chemistry. He passed his master's degree in 1894 from the Presidency College, Kolkata. In M.B. Examination of 1900 of the University of Calcutta, he stood first in medicine and in surgery for which he received Goodeve and MacLeod awards. He obtained his MD degree in 1902, and was awarded a PhD degree in 1904, for his research paper on studies in hemolysis, both from the University of Calcutta. In 1898, he married Nani Bala Devi. Brahmachari joined the Provincial Medical Service in September 1899 and appointed as a teacher of pathology and materia medica, and physician in the Dhaka Medical School in 1901. In 1905, he was appointed as a teacher in medicine and physician at the Campbell Medical School Nil Ratan Sirkar Medical College and Hospital, Calcutta, where he carried out most of his work on Kala Azar and made his monumental discovery of urea stibamine. In 1923, he joined as additional physician in the Medical College Hospital. He retired from the government service as a physician in 1927. After retirement from the government service Brahmachari joined the Carmichael Medical College in Kolkata as professor of tropical diseases. He also served the National Medical Institute, in charge of its tropical disease ward. He was also the head of the Department of Biochemistry and Honorary Professor of Biochemistry at the University College of Science, Calcutta. Around 1924, Brahmachari established the Brahmachari Research Institute in his own residence in Cornwallis Street, Vidhan Sarani, Kolkata. This institute was later converted into a partnership concern with his sons Fanindra Nath and Nirmal Kumar. Under his guidance, this institute did quite well both in the fields of research and manufacture of medicine. The institute stopped functioning in 1963. <inaudible> <inaudible> Social services Brahmachari played an important part in the formation of the world's second blood bank in Kolkata in 1939. He was the chairman of the Blood Transfusion Service of Bengal. He was the vice president of the St. John Ambulance Association of the Bengal branch and also its president. He was the first Indian to become the chairman of the managing body of the Indian Red Cross Society of the Bengal branch. He generously contributed to the high school in Purbasthali in Bardaman district near his ancestral house. The school was later renamed the Purbasthali Nilmani Brahmachari Institution. Awards and honours For his achievements, he received many awards, including the Griffith Memorial Prize of the University of Calcutta, the Minto Medal by the Calcutta School of Tropical Medicine and Hygiene and the Sir William Jones Medal by the Asiatic Society of Bengal. 
He was awarded the title of Rai Bahadur and awarded the Kaiser I Hind Gold Medal, first class by the Governor General Lord Lytton. In 1934, he was conferred a knighthood by the British government. Brahmachari was a nominee for the Nobel Prize in 1929 in the category of Physiology and Medicine. He was president of the 23rd session of the Indian Science Congress in Indore. 1936. He was the president of the Indian Chemical Society, Calcutta 1936. He was honoured with the fellowships of the Royal Society of Medicine, London and the Indian National Science Academy as well as the president of the Asiatic Society of Bengal for two years 1928-29. He was also the vice chairman of the board of trustees of the Indian Museum. The Kolkata Municipal Corporation renamed Loudoun Street the Dr. U.N. Brahmachari Street. Topic important works Some of his important works are, Studies in Hemolysis, University of Calcutta, 1909. Kala Azar, Its Treatment, Butterworth & Co., Ltd. Calcutta 1917. Kala Azar in Dr. Karl Menz's Handbuch der Tropenkrankheiten, Vol. 4, 1926. Treatise on Kala Azar, John Bale, Sons & Daniel Son Ltd., London, 1928. Campaign against Kala Azar in India in Jubilee publication on the 80th birthday of Dr. Prof. Bernhard Nacht, Hamburg, 1937. Progress of medical research work in India during the last 25 years, and progress of science in India, during the past 25 years, Indian Science Congress Association 1938. Gleanings from my researchers Vol. I, University of Calcutta, 1940. Gleanings from my researchers Vol. 2, University of Calcutta, 1941. Infantile biliary cirrhosis in India in British Encyclopedia of Medical Practice edited by Sir Humphrey Rolleston. <laughs> Notes <laughs>